<laughs> it's boiled eggs with bacon. Let's, yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> She's like laughing maniacally. Hey guys, it's the Gaming Mermaid and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be checking out the newest stuff pack, laundry day stuff for The Sims 4. So it says we can wash our wardrobe, we can build a rustic home and dress in country style. So let's go ahead and check it out in the game. I'm going to go ahead and play with Harley Quinn and Joker. So let's go ahead and get this started. Alrighty, so here we are in Create a Sim and this is my Harley Quinn for my Harley Quinn and Joker 100 baby challenge. So right now she has a baby on the way but maybe that'll be interesting in case nobody else shows that what it looks like for pregnant women to uh wear the clothes and stuff like that so anyways let's go ahead and get this started there's no new uh skin details as far as i am aware of so that's a thing obviously no teeth let's go on and move on to the hairs now let's see this is the first hair i think this one is super adorable what is this on the top i think that might be um my custom content to be honest <laughs> um having that little blue strip there yeah um just ignore or that but here are all the different colors very nice i love this red one. Oh my goodness and let me check this one out as well all right all right that's definitely my custom content i do apologize for that but i just love this one with the little clip in the back looking absolutely adorable i love how this kind of just like flows with the face shape very nice and flattering very nice indeed so anyways let me see what else we have here do we have any eyebrows that's always a thing i like to check for oh uh, let's see nope no new eyebrows so those are the two hairs and here are all the different colorways. so let's go ahead and move on to the hats do we have any hats here um according to this this is supposed to be for laundry day i highly doubt that so yeah no <laughs> anyways let's go ahead and move on to accessories there were no accessories so let's move on to makeup no makeup either all right all right let's see here so body do we have any tattoos let me go ahead and check it out here it looks like there are probably no tattoos here nope no new tattoos style looks though let me go ahead and check this one out fresh boho chic oh okay so this is oh that actually looks really flattering for a pregnant woman how adorable is that i love it <gasps> how cute are these little socks Oh my goodness, she looks so adorable with that on. And we can check out the different colors. That's a nice color as well. Look at that, it even shows her little tattoos. Very cute. All right, so here are all the different colors. Very nice, we have another one, Sunday Best. Ooh, oh, that one is super pretty. Maybe not flattering on a pregnant woman, but I think this one is really, really gorgeous. I love this detail. Is that like supposed to be embroidered? How lovely is that? That looks absolutely gorgeous. Oh, that one's super cute as well. Well, very nice. I like this one a lot. All right, all right. Next up, we have tops with knots. Oh, this is a cute little casual sporty look. I like that one. Very nice. Very country-like, I think. Oh, that's a lovely color on her as well. Look how nice. Oh, I love that one too. Alrighty, next up, we have country vibes. Ooh, I love this top. This is definitely very flattering for Harley right now. How lovely is that? All right, let's check out the different colors. Ooh, that pattern is super pretty. I love that. Oh, that is gorgeous. Let me see this color. Nice, nice. That one's really pretty as well. All right, so that is all the styles looks. So let's go ahead and check out the tops individually now. So this was the first one with the embroidered look and it comes in many different lovely colors as well. Nice and like more muted, you know, more rustic as they describe it anyway. Anyways, Oh, it has a little top knot right there. Very cute. I love the pattern. Let me check out the colors here. Very, oh, and there's some solid colors as well. Oh, that is so nice. Oh, that's a beautiful color. Very nice. I love it. <laughs> Alrighty, next up, we have this top here. Very cool, very party-like. And it also comes in many gorgeous colors as well. Look at that. And then this one, I think... This one might be my favorite. This one looks super beautiful. Very nice indeed. And I love the ombre effect as well. Very, very nice. And oh, and look at this one. Oh, this is a nice little trendy top. Very nice. Maybe even for like an athletic wear. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at that little design. I like that one. These are gorgeous, by the way. Oh my goodness. I love the patterns on these. Even the solid ones are just very cute. Very nice basic top. And then I don't think that is part of the... Well, I have it set to laundry day only, but I don't know why it's showing that. Anyways, let's move on to the pants. All right, so this is the first pair of pants. Let me just get rid of these so that we can check them out. So they're like kind of high water, 
kind of lower waisted and they have a nice big belt on them let me go ahead and check out the colors very nice i like those colors a lot of good variety and a lot of different colors i wouldn't expect for pants like orange <laughs> but anyways um is this part no i don't know why it's showing me get to work anyways let's go ahead and check out the accessories oh that's right okay before we do that let's check out the dresses so this is the first dress i think this looks really nice especially on a pregnant woman i will go ahead and age up one of the children i think i'll go ahead and age up my little toddler here to a teenager just so that we can see what it looks like on normal people that aren't pregnant but anyways let's go ahead and check out the colors i'm not sure how i feel about the flower look it, it looks kind of cluttered i definitely prefer the solid ones in my opinion i think these look so beautiful and i love this little layered effect right here just so gorgeous in my opinion but anyways that is the one and only uh full body for the women now we can check out the accessories which are these cute little stockings how adorable is that little over knee socks and they have a nice little textured pattern on them so i think that is really really nice Alrighty, so let's go ahead and check out these shoes now Ooh, we have some options i don't know if this is an option let me just check okay so we have two options here so we have the boots very nice i like these i like the little wrinkled effect <laughs> that they have i think that looks really nice on them and again a lot of different colors and we also have these let me just get rid of these socks so that we can actually see them how cute are these little wedges my mom is obsessed with wedges like these i could totally see her wearing these seriously <laughs> in every color oh my goodness these are so beautiful for the summertime so i'm kind of surprised that they put this out in the winter but anyways i'm not complaining they look super adorable and i always welcome some new shoes in the sims 4 all right so i think that is everything for the women let's go ahead and move on over to um let me actually check this really quickly first of all here's a little toddler do we have anything for the toddlers that is the question no styled looks no tops uh no full bodies no um bottoms <laughs> no accessories and no shoes so nothing for the toddlers so i'm gonna just go ahead and age her up into a teenager <gasps> Oh my goodness. Okay, so let me go ahead and check out. Actually, let's give her a little hair. First of all, there we go. There we go. Now, let's go ahead and check out what these tops look like on a uh, on a non-pregnant sim. That's what I wanted to say. All right, all right. So this is what it looks like when it's not like protruded out. Very nice. And I think it looks nice on either non-pregnant or pregnant sims. So that's pretty awesome indeed. All right, let's check out another styled look. All right, so this is what it looks like without being pregnant. I think she looks so nice with this on this is a really this is just beautiful it's just beautiful i love it okay so next up we have the tops with knots oh that is so cute so cute on her she just looks good in everything look at that i love it all right and then the next one we have here is country vibes so let's go ahead and change the color here yeah that one looks really nice as well so that's what it looks like on a non-pregnant sim just so you guys know so now let's move on to the men so we're gonna go over here with the joker and let's go ahead and check this out i don't think there's anything no skin tones or anything like that so let's just move on to the hairs so we have one hair right here it's a longer hair looking pretty sleek pretty nice and i like this little flowy bit on the side i don't know why i just really like it and i think that looks interesting on joker <laughs> anyways let's check out the other colors shall we let's just move back a little bit so we can see all right all right i like it it oh i just i'm just i don't know why i'm obsessed with reds don't know what it is i wish i could dye my hair red but my hair is too dark for that but anyways look at this color oh my goodness okay so that is the one and only hair do we have any facial hair <gasps> That is the question. I didn't check on that. Let me go ahead and do so. Okay, no facial hair. Do we have any hats? No hats. Uh, let's see, no accessories and no makeup. Actually, you know what? Let me go ahead and do a double take because I don't think I checked this on the females. Let's see, hats, no hats no accessories, no makeup. Okay, I just wanted to do a double check. Okay, so let's go ahead and move on to the style look. So we have comfortably torn. Let's check it out. Okay, do apologize for Joker looking the way he does. He's gained a little bit of weight because he's about to turn into an elder. So uh, don't mind that. I know it's sad. Uh, it's very sad indeed. But here are all the different colors. Oh my goodness. You know what? When he becomes an elder, I could totally see him wearing something like this. Oh my 
goodness. <laughs> Grandpa Joker. Alrighty, and then the next look we have here is Relaxed Fit. And this looks like a more surfer dude type of vibe that I'm getting from this, but it's very cool. I like it. Very cool indeed. Oh, I like this pattern as well. Oh yeah, I like that one. And that one. All right, all right, all right. So let's go ahead and move on to the tops individually. So we have this top right here. Let's just take a look, see here. So it's like a little half button down shirt. Nice pattern we got going on. And let's see, we have some solid colors here as well. Some stripes and, oh, uh, I guess if you wanted to make like hobos <laughs> in The Sims, they could totally wear this one like dirty. Uh, alrighty, and we have some more solid colors here as well. All right, all right. So that is what that one looks like. This one, I kind of like a little bit more. I definitely love the pattern and I think it looks really nice. Oh, this one's really nice too. Oh my goodness. I love all of these colors. Very nice. I love that one. Now, let's go ahead and check this one out. So this is the one with little pockets. It's a little bit more of a surfer type of vibe that I'm getting from it, but it has similar patterns from the other shirt. Wait, they look pretty similar, you know? Hmm. Okay, so this one's a little bit lower and this one's more of a V-neck. All right, and then it's like kind of asymmetrical. I like that. Very cool. All right, all right. So let's check the colors. And that is not part of the pack. Why? <laughs> That's not laundry day. Okay, anyways, let's check out the pants over here. So I'm pretty sure that's not, okay. Okay, so the first pants over here are these with some torn up, torn up jeans and stuff like that. I love these colors. I know I keep saying that, but I do. They look really nice. All right, so next up we have these pants as well. Okay, so we have some solid colors here. Very cool. All right, and then some crazy patterns as well. So that is, I like them. Pretty nice. All right, let's go ahead and move on to the full body. No full body for the males. All right, and then the uh, shoes. Don't think those are I don't I don't think those are no why why get to work get to work wants to be so relevant right now okay so that is everything for the males let's go ahead and move on to one of the children here let's go ahead and see if there's anything for them no hairs uh no hats no accessories and no makeup so yeah I wasn't expecting any makeup anyways we do have a shirt here let's go ahead and check that oh my goodness how cute is that <gasps> is it like a two layer that is adorable okay let's check out the colors here oh Oh, that is so cute so it's like matching with the pattern how adorable is that we have some solids some stripes and all of that jazz so here we go oh my goodness I love that one on him do we have any pants to go with it <gasps> no why couldn't we have the pants that, 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 that he has huh we could have totally had these for the little kids but anyways it's all right it's all right do we have any shoes nope no shoes no accessories and do we have any style looks no. Oh, we, yes, we do. Okay. <laughs> Here's a styled look. So basically the only thing part of this pack is the top for the children anyway. Hmm. I wonder if, if it's different for a female. I'm just going to check that out really quickly. Nope. It's this, it's the exact same thing. Ooh, oh, oh, okay. So the girls have a dress as well. <gasps> How adorable is that? Again, with the embroidery looking absolutely lovely. I love it. Oh my goodness. That's so cute, but it's very springy. Again, I don't understand why they put this out in the winter time because this definitely looks more springy, summery. But anyways, I think it looks really nice. That's adorable. All right, so that is everything for the children. And then you guys saw what it looks like for a pregnant woman and a non-pregnant woman. Here's a styled look. Let's check it out. How adorable is that? Let's check out the colors. That one looks super nice on her. Very nice indeed. All right, so that is everything that we have in the stuff pack in the create sim anyway. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in game so we can actually wash some clothes. Why it's not so excited. All right, all right, so it is time for us to make a laundry room. So there are many rooms in this household that I don't even use. So I think what we're gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna use one of the rooms. I think, let me see, I have this room here that I never use. I have this room that I never use either. Um, I think we're gonna go ahead and put the laundry room over here because I never use this area anyway Unfortunately, even though Harley Quinn is a scientist 
Hmm, maybe I should change this one up then. Hmm? Yeah, let's go ahead and do that because I don't even use any of this stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and sell all this. So let's go ahead and check this out now. We have Wicker Whim's living chair, looking like so. Let's go ahead and check that out, shall we? So it's a very nice little wicker chair, like it says, and it comes in many different colors. So I'm pretty sure this was meant for outdoors and stuff like that. I think it looks really cute. I love it already. So next up we have another Wicker Whim's dining chair. Ooh fancy and it comes in all the same colors very nice variety of colors as well we have a wicker whims love seat how adorable is that let's check that out shall we all right and it comes in all these colors very nice i love it too let's see the bottom in <laughs> how cute is that so you could put it like that and be like oh yeah relaxing and we have dinners on by crockery kitchen let's check that out shall we all right, all right, let's check the colors over here. All right, so it's obviously a wooden table with many different colors. Ooh, that one looks so cute. How adorable is that? Alrighty, I'm gonna go ahead and sell all of these. Next up, we have the odds end table. Let's check that out, shall we? And let's see, what kind of colors do we have? All right, so a lot of nice rustic, natural looking colors for a wooden table, yes fantastic next up we have <laughs> when life gives you linens yes oh uh that's very yep that is definitely rustic indeed very rusty oh well that's cute for a little laundry room so, well this is a giant room but anyways i don't mind that let me check the colors on this as well let's see oh that's cute <gasps> this one's nice i like that one and we have this kind a nice vibrant color some natural colors a blue one very cool i like this color actually we'll go with that one and let's see what else we have coffee squared <laughs> coffee squared let's check that one out so obviously it's a coffee table with many different colors very nice already so that would be great in the kitchen we have a muck down cabinet oh okay this would be nice and you have your little coats and stuff like that i wonder if you could put stuff on the shelves I guess so, probably. Next up, what do we have here? Wicker Whims Shelving. Oh, okay, very cool. And let's see the colors on that. So we have a few colors. Next up, we have the Dutch Hutch. Let's check that out, shall we? Oh, okay, so yes, you should definitely be able to put some stuff on there. I think I saw in the trailer there were like little folded clothes and stuff, so we'll go ahead and check if that's still available. But anyways, let's see here. It comes in all of the similar colors as the tables and shelves and whatnot. Next up, we have laundry made essential shelving. So let's check that out, shall we? Oh, I see. Oh, how cute is that? It has a little iron. Oh, how cool would it be if the iron was actually functional? So we have an iron, we have some towels, a nice little plant. Very nice. Oh, and little hangers. How cute. Why am I amused by the most simplest things? But anyways, I love this color. Oh, just so lovely. Just so lovely and natural. So next up we have Laundry Made Deluxe Shelving. Oh yeah, let's check that out, shall we? This kind of reminds me of like Ikea or something. I don't even know. But anyways, it goes, it has some laundry stuff, obviously. And some nicer looking hangers than the other ones. The other hangers kind of look kind of look like they were half made and <laughs> these actually look like hangers interesting interesting all right let's check the colors on that so similar colors as all of the other shelves as well we have a diy sink well isn't that helpful wow look at that just lovely we have like some towels paper towels and like a, I guess dishwashing liquid soap or whatever look at these colors all right all right same colors as the shelves as well oh and then we have the buy I don't know what that says buy something galvanist sink let's go ahead and check that one out all right wow is that like a it looks like a, a suitcase or something I don't know all right let's check the color uh that's that's not so lovely <laughs> that's very uh very old if you were making maybe that would be cool if you were making like an abandoned house or a haunted house or something and then you have all of this like crazy looking old stuff that uh, like a horror movie oh my goodness i could totally see that for somebody building something next up we have the green clean washing machine oh yeah so this is the modern washing machine and i noticed in the trailer i don't know why it just bothered me because the buttons just look just look I don't the, the graphics are just not that not quite what I would have hoped for the sims 4 it just anyways it was just bothering me the buttons just they don't look very very 
crisp, you know? I don't know. Anyways, that's my only real complaint so far is just the, the buttons. They just don't look nice in my opinion. I love this mint green color, so we're gonna go with that one. And then we have a fire dryer. Oh yeah. You know what? That reminds me of a song that I was obsessed with back in the day called Firewire. I don't know why I was obsessed with that song. Anyway, so we have the washer and the dryer. And look, it even has the little icon so you know which one is which. Thank you because I wouldn't have been able to tell otherwise. And we also have a stackable one. So I don't think we can stack these individually on top of each other unless you use like cheats or whatever. But we do have one that's already stacked for you. So there we go there. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can you move this? Oh, you can. Oh, so this actually makes it possible for you to stack it. Okay, cool. So I wonder, um, it has the dryer on top. Could you put the, the dryer on the bottom? No, the dryer has to be on the top. Apparently you can't you can't do it the other way. Ah, I see. Okay, then. Well, <laughs> we don't need that many. <laughs> All right, I'll go ahead and um, put that away. So that, the both of them is 1,025. Individually, it's 525. So so actually, wouldn't it be cheaper to get this together? Yeah, interesting. Okay, then we have old Timmy's wash tub. Oh my goodness. What did that say? Rub-a-dub-dub. -dub. Oh my gosh. Guys, like, wasn't this from like 1900s? Like, nobody washes clothes like this anymore. Does anybody wash clothes like this anymore? Seriously? Seriously? Wow, that's pretty crazy, but we're gonna use it. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that right there. We have a Wicker Whims hamper that would be useful to have as well. And then we have a feeling fabric hamper. Oh yeah. So let's go ahead and check the colors on those, shall we? All right, all right. So we have some some of the same colors as the other shelving and things like that. Okay, this one, the colors aren't as vibrant at all whatsoever, but that's fine. It's a hamper. Anyways, we have a Model T clothesline. Let me just go ahead and check that out. Uh oh, I'm gonna have to put that outside. Uh oh, let's put that over here. So I did a little bit of rearranging, which I will get to shortly in this room. But next up, we have the laundry made clothing hamper. So we have three different hampers. Let me go ahead and check on the colors for this. Oh, well, this one, I think this one might match the washer and dryer. Look at that. We can have the same color. Very cute. And then next up, we have a Wicker Whims Potpourri. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, that is lovely. You know what? We should go ahead and put that outside, shall we? I'll have to change my little Christmas decorations, but look how lovely this is. Let's check the colors on this. All right, all right. So the flowers don't change colors, just the wicker. That's fine. Alrighty, next up we have Barry's Pottered, what? <laughs> oh, Barry Potter's Potted Plant. <gasps> okay, I see. I see what they did there. Let me go ahead. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Barry Potter's, be sure to say the magic phrase that pays. Hocus ficus? Barry Potter? Are they trying to tell us something? Is this a hint? Is this a hint for an upcoming pack? For, I don't know, maybe witches and wizards? <gasps> you guys, I hope this is a hint because that sounds amazing. <gasps> I really hope that's that's actually a hint. Ooh, le next up we have succulents. Succulents, I love succulents, but the problem is, is that I'm really bad at taking care of plants. So I actually have a fake one <laughs> now uh, because yeah, my poor little succulents just like could not live could not live with me. But look at these lovely colors. All right, so the succulents don't change colors, just the wood, just the wooden frame, but that's pretty cool. Next up, we have Debra Laundry Detergent. Look, looking like Snuggle over here. We can go ahead and put that in the shelves, right? Look at this, so we can put it on the shelf right there. How cute is that? And three different colors in that color way. All right, next up, we have the Laundry Made Galvanized Bucket, so we can go ahead and put that right there. And then we have uh, something in French, Wicker Whims, some laundry baskets. We'll go ahead and put that right there. Let me go ahead and check on the colors for that. All right, so it's all like natural colors. What about this? Can we change the, oh, we can. Oh, we can change the colors of this. How cool is that? Next up, we have Still Country Life. How lovely. Oh, that looks beautiful as well. Oh my goodness. I am just obsessed with all of these lovely plants and stuff. I just, I just love the look of succulents. I think they just look beautiful. Kind of Thanksgiving-like. I don't know. That's the vibe that I'm getting from that. We have cute little pumpkins. <gasps> Wait, can we change the colors? We cannot change the colors of this. Interesting. Interesting. All right, next up we have the utilitarian utility mat. Let's, oh, that's that's a pretty big mat. Let's go ahead and check on that. Let's see here. What does that look like? Okay, it's pretty basic. Let's see if there's any other colors. So it's all like natural muted colors. Very cool. Ooh, <gasps> a scalloped escape. Oh, that is beautiful. 
Oh, I love it. It looks like rope. How gorgeous is that? And it comes in a ton of different colors. Oh, I love that. That is just gorgeous. I'm going to go ahead and put it in that colorway. Let's see. Fruit of the Loon rug. How cute is that? Let's just put that right there for right now so we can just check on that. Wow, that's a beautiful pattern. That one's very nice and natural as well. Oh, I love it. Beautiful colors. Love those rugs. Definitely. I'm going to go ahead and put that in this room right here. All right, for the little toddlers. Next up, oh, there's so many rugs in here. Let's see, Wicker Whims rug. Let's check on that. Another one that looks like a wicker and wood and all of that jazz and a lot of muted colors. Next up, we have Fringe Benefits. Wait, <laughs> Fringe Benefits rug. I thought it said Friends Benefits. I was like, what? What is going on? Did I miss this one? Simoleon and Matt. Sim Simolonian Matt. Oh my gosh, but this one's super pretty. <gasps> Look at all those colors looking gorgeous as well. Let me check on the fringe mat over here just for now. Let's see. Oh, I love it. Gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Love the love those colors as well. And then next up we have the eclectic rug trio. Oh my goodness. Look how many rugs. So many rugs. So I think um originally they were just going to do this one in particular, but people love the rugs so much that they wanted them individually. So I think that's why we have so many rug options because they did the trio and they put them all individually as well, which is awesome because I think that will be great for builders who just want to be creative and all of that jazz so that is pretty awesome next up we have the zydeco rub board um do we need this for um uh, sewing no not sewing washing clothes do we need this for washing clothes i'm not sure i don't know if we can actually interact with this so i'm gonna go ahead and actually put that right there there we go and then hopefully maybe we'll see if we have to actually use that oh a clean sweep so we have a little broom and a little dust pan very cute indeed let's check on the colors for that so the dust pan and the wooden board here the little wooden plank change colors and a little little uh, band on the broom change colors as well let's see let's go ahead and get it in this color i just like that one next up we have redundant towel rack <laughs> so there it is let's see if there's any other colors oh that's cute oh that looks adorable very cute indeed Alrighty, and then next up we have oh wreath of living brambles oh my goodness look at this description though a uh, magic item lore item no drop i don't know if this is a glitch with the coding or what but it says causes sims to be less hateful of any heal or damage spell guys spells like magic spells hold on guys magic spells oh my goodness we need to check on that wait so does that mean that we're gonna get like witches and wizards i was not expecting that in a stuff pack but anyways we'll have to find out crockery kitchen herb rack oh that is super cute you know what we should actually put that in the kitchen how cool would that be we'll put it right there let's check on the colors wrong one here we go oh okay so the uh wooden panel changes colors very cool very cool andy i'm gonna go ahead and change to that one next up we have press to impress an ironing board <gasps> how cute is that let me go over here so that we can check on that so let's see the colors here all right all right oh that's cute oh that's adorable super adorable we're gonna go with that one and then we have the emergency laundry kit so it's the same thing but actually it comes with all of the other things that we had here individually how cool is that so it's all in one so you know if you're like me and you don't like to build it's already done for you it's already arranged for you so that is fantastic actually I think we should go ahead and just keep that one there and then I'll go ahead and get rid of the other stuff already so next up ooh, wicker whims candle bowl <gasps> that is beautiful that looks gorgeous let's go ahead and check the colors okay so it's all very natural so that is pretty pretty nice I'm gonna go ahead and choose that color and then last but not least we have eco-friendly light bulb Ooh, let's check on that all right all right so it's literally a light bulb hanging from the ceiling but hey that's pretty cool are there any colors I'm just curious oh there are oh how cool is that we'll go with the gold yes that looks pretty awesome I, I just have to centerize it because it's bothering me that it's not centerized there we go oh cool you guys 
All right, so that was everything in the stuff pack. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I could just put some of the furniture outside. We're gonna check on the gameplay very shortly, but I definitely wanna make sure that I check out what that magic spell thing is all about. Like seriously, we need to find out if that actually works because that was pretty crazy. So here are the new outfits that I gave Harley Quinn and Joker for now, just featuring all the laundry day stuff. So Joker's gonna be leaving for work in about two hours. So he will be leaving shortly, but we still have a Harley Quinn over here where is she going no oh, she's thinking about doll houses and stuff I have errors going on I do apologize for that looks like we don't have anything to interact with for the the hampers just yet let's see we could upgrade <gasps> whisper quiet hold on let me just pause this for a moment whisper quiet tungsten drum oh speed cycle and lintless Ooh, very cool so we need our handiness skill to improve in order to upgrade the washing machine and dryer can we what can we do here okay so this is like a basic sink that's fine that's fine you know what let's go ahead and check this one out okay so i got two sinks the two sinks here just to make sure that i'm not missing out on anything can we interact with anything you guys we can't interact with this but it definitely said you could do magic spells guys I, uh, <laughs> I i'm not going crazy right that has to be a hint you guys then that's right we're gonna get magic spells and witches and wizards is that what that's telling me because if so if so, I am excited about it. We can't interact with it at all, so I'm really sad about that. But anyways, let's continue on. What can we interact with? Okay, so we can turn these on. All candles, all rooms, set the color and intensity, just like the lights. So that is pretty cool indeed. We can't interact with any of this stuff. So since we are good to go there, let me go ahead and check on what we have here. I had the new little wicker stuff. Put Quinn here. Yes, put her there. Oh, yes. All right. We could actually sit and nap on this as well how cute is that <gasps> i want to put quinn here oh my goodness i need to see what that looks like <gasps> let's see here so i have this little washing thingy add laundry additive <gasps> the wait no our power got shut off are you serious okay well we're not going to be able to use the washing machines just yet, but it looks like we could at least use this. Hey, you know what? I mean, if you have your power out, then you could just use this to wash your clothes, right? Add flowers or add food. <gasps> Let's check that out. Wait, grapes? Can we add grapes? <laughs> what does that look like? <gasps> oh my god, wait, where's Quinn? Oh. Oh, there she is. Okay, um, she's getting a little smelly. We're gonna have to change her diaper. But I just wanna see what it looks like with the little toddler on the ottoman. <gasps> oh my gosh, she's so cute. <gasps> How adorable is that? Who is calling? Who is calling Keith? <gasps> Jinx is wondering if I wanna go over her house. Oh my goodness, Jinx, you need to come over here. Oh my gosh, look how adorable. She's just chilling there. Can you do anything? Sit and nap. Can you nap? I just wanna see what that looks like. Oh, she is gonna nap, I think. <gasps> oh my gosh, wait, 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 is she gonna? Oh my gosh, she's so cute. <gasps> How adorable is that? Look at her, look at adorable. I think she added some grapes. <gasps> look at that. It, 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 there's butterflies looking beautiful and we can replace the water. Okay, what does that look like? Hmm. Okay, so are the butterflies still there? The butterflies are still there, look at that. <gasps> Okay, so let me try that again because I didn't actually see what that looks like. Oh, she just dropped it. Those definitely were not flowers. Let me see. No, <gasps> it's sparkling though. <gasps> How cool is that? Wait a minute. Oh, what is she doing? Oh my gosh, hold on. Oh, she's gonna be asked advice. Okay, let's replace the water. Okay then, what was the other one? Add food, let's add some food. Uh, I don't know if I want to add that, but hey, it's boiled eggs with bacon. Let's, yeah, oh boy. <laughs> she's like laughing maniacally uh, uh oh my god you could do so many pranks with that <gasps> wait so if you wash clothes with spoiled food in it oh so all your clothes would be dirty so um harley accidentally you know she, she just had a little accident um and uh now she is very dirty so we're gonna go ahead and have her go to take a shower or a bath a little one you need to leave oh my goodness he's not leaving go over here please please yes go on the jungle gym please do do something with your life except being in the in the bathroom uh oh is he feeling is he feeling he's not feeling well why don't you go ahead wait i can't take any medicine he can't take any medicine. My boy, what are you doing? I need to <laughs> take a bath. Oh, our lonely recess. Last recess, no one wanted to play with me. Oh, no. Well, ask other kids if you can join. 
All right, hopefully that helps him, the poor thing. All right, can you leave now, please? I'm just, I'm, I'm serious. Okay, you guys, I don't know why, but my game gets very glitchy and there's always errors, so I do apologize for the delay. Now, what I think is what we need to do in order, ooh, let's take a bath with, uh, never mind. I was gonna say, let's take a bath with Silks. You know what, let's just be glad that she's actually taking a bath. So that is great. Now, I think we obviously need to go ahead and either take a shower or take a bath because then they need to change their clothes. And once they change their clothes, then we can actually do the laundry. <laughs> Who would have thought? So I'm just gonna go ahead and have her take a bath and hopefully we'll go ahead and check and see if there's any laundry to do. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and check on this here. Oh yes, we can do the laundry, wash and wash tub or add to washing machine. I did pay the bill so we have power now, thank goodness. So I think we're, oh, and search pockets. Um, interesting. Is that because she's a klepto? <laughs> Is that because she's a kleptomaniac? We'll have to find out. So we can add to the washing machine or wash and wash tub. So I'm gonna try both. I think for the first one, I'm very curious because we did make it with spoiled water, with spoiled eggs, like rotten eggs. Look at that, that, oh my gosh, there's flies everywhere. <gasps> Oh boy, I, I'm so curious to see what that looks like. So I think that's what we are gonna go ahead and do. First off, I'm just gonna search the pockets. I'm gonna search the pockets. Everybody is off to school now. Let's see here. What is she? <laughs> she's searching the pockets of the clothes. I mean, they're her own clothes, so I don't know what she's gonna be taking. And I also gave little bit of Quinn over here a bath. Uh oh. <gasps> Uh oh, she's tired, girl. Go, go sleep. Go to sleep, please. Oh my goodness. Okay, so she got money somehow from her own toddler <laughs> or herself. I don't know. Let me go ahead and have everybody study. Oh, did you see that? We just had clothes just like plop in there. Uh, none of these other ones have clothes. Well, how convenient. We're gonna go ahead and add, no, we're gonna wash in the wash tub. That is what we're gonna do when she is done using the facilities. It is time, it is time. Please errors, please. Okay, here we go. So, <laughs> where is she going? Okay, I think she's gonna go outside. <gasps> Look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at all those dirty laundry. All that dirty laundry. All right, so she's gonna go over here, I believe. And I also put some, oh, whoa. <laughs> I also put some of these furniture thingies over here as well. So we can just have them outside. So apparently this table, you can actually fit six chairs. In case you are wondering, let me go ahead and show you what that would look like. So let's go ahead and get some of these up in here. So yes, look at that. How awesome is that? So you can actually put six chairs on this table that comes in the laundry day stuff pack. Now, oh, I paused it, my bad. Here we go. Oh my gosh, is that rotten egg stuff? Oh my goodness, wait a minute, wait a minute. What is that? Are those the dirty laundry? Oh my gosh, okay girl. Let's uh take a look. See, she's very tired right now, girl, what? Oh my gosh, everything's gonna smell. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, let's check it out, let's check it out. I mean, that's a lot of lather and stuff. Ooh, she's getting tired. I mean, she is, you know, preggers and stuff like that. Okay, so now we can unload and move laundry. We could hang it on the clothesline or add to the dryer. So first off, we're doing it the old fashioned way. So we could hang it on the clothesline or we can unload and set laundry down. This load of laundry is cleanness pristine. Are you sure? And dryness soaked. <laughs> what? Okay, I'm confused. We're gonna go ahead and put it on the clothesline. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, she's getting hungry, but we don't have time for that right now. She's still washing clothes though. I don't know. Oh, here we go. So it's gonna take a little bit of a while longer to do. Okay, she's making a huge mess everywhere. <laughs> with this spoiled rotten egg water. <laughs> We're almost done with the laundry. So hopefully she will go ahead and hang it on the clothesline. I wonder if all the clothes are gonna be like super smelly. Look at her just dumping it in there. <gasps> Look at the water, ew. That water is horrendous. Are you serious? Look, oh my goodness. Look at this water. Okay, well, <laughs> let's see what this uh, looks like on the clothing. Whoa, she, she did that like crazy fast. Oh my goodness, all the undergarments and all that stuff. Look at that. Well, they don't look smelly. So that's a thing. Hold on. Is this, wait. 
So you could unload and set laundry down. Oh, and it shows you. So the cleanliness is pristine. It's pristinely clean. I don't know how in that rotten egg water. And the dryness is damp. So I guess uh, once it becomes dry, then we can go ahead and unload. She's talking to herself now. Um. Okay, so that was a thing. We'll see how that goes. Let's replace this water, shall we? And then we'll go ahead and add some grapes into there to see if we have some grape, some grape clothes. Hmm? <laughs> yes, please change that. How did you do that? I don't know. What? What in the world? Okay, add laundry additive. We're gonna add some grapes up in here. There we go. Now it has beautiful sparkles and butterflies in it. Oh yeah, okay. So now <laughs> let's go ahead and check on and see if we have any other clothes in here. Yes, okay, good. So let's go ahead and add these to the washing machine this time. Who is calling? Huh, hey poker, we'd love to have you join Paragons. Um, not right now, Harleen. We don't have time for that right now, but we're going to go ahead and wash the clothes in the washing machine this time. Let's go ahead and check that out, shall we? Come on, Harley. I know you can go over here. There we go. Alrighty, so more clothes. Yes. <laughs> All right, let's check this out. Hold on. You are, you're, you're going a little too quick for me. Okay, so she just dumps it on in there. There we go. Do you have to press any buttons? No, it just automatically. Okay, look at those buttons. I'm just, I'm just not a fan of. Look, why? What? They look so. Uh, those graphics. I don't. I can't. Okay. Anyways, so she's just gonna leave it. Where is she going? I don't know. She's gonna go dance. Okay. So, um, I think we should actually wash the laundry. You know, I, I think that would be uh, really helpful to do. She just dumped it in there, but she didn't, she didn't press the button or anything. What are you doing, girl? What are you doing? Okay, here we go. Press that horrendous looking button. All right, all right. There we go. Yay, now it's actually washing. I'm curious. I, I, I'm, I'm curious. Let's take a little uh, adventure into the washing machine. Can we go in the, wa we're in the washing machine. Look, we're in the washing machine. Oh, what? Where are the clothes? Uh uh the oh oh wow look at that those graphics of the water oh so now we're in the washing machine you guys if you ever wondered what it's like to be in a washing machine because i kind of wondered this is what it's like yep just gotta soak on in there tumbling around oh yeah <laughs> so what else can we do watch laundry yes Go ahead and do that. <laughs> that sounds like so much fun. How exciting. Wow, I am so excited. This is the most exciting thing of my life. Watching laundry. Yes, that's what I've always wanted to do with my life. Ooh, it looks like we have some turbos now. Wait a minute, there's no clothes in there. Uh, what happened to the clothes? There are no clothes in existence in the washing machine. Uh, okay then. <laughs> I don't know what happened to the clothes. They like disappeared. This thing is going so fast that the clothes actually disappeared. Oh, it's done. What? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Why does it have a fish? Huh? Why does it have a fish symbol and then a flower symbol? Hmm? I don't know, you guys. All right, all right. So we can unload and set laundry down or we can unload and move laundry to the dryer. So that's what we want to go ahead and do. Let's go ahead and check that out, shall we, Harley? Here we go. So she's going to take them on up. All right, and then dump them on in. Now, uh, you have to actually dry it. You have to actually press the button. Can she reach that? Oh, yeah. Yeah, she can reach that. No problem. Oh, yeah. Let's see here. Alrighty, now, if you guys are wondering, ooh, oh, he's gonna become an A, straight A student. How awesome is that? This is what it's like to be in a dryer. Let's check it out. Yes, wow, I can't even see. <laughs> That's a little trippy look. It even has like, well, it kind of looks like fog. Yeah, it looks like there's fog in there. That's gonna take a little bit of a while. Let's go ahead and wash our laundry because that, that's what I've always wanted to do with my life. The most exciting thing in the world, yes. She's thinking about cupcakes and stuff like that. What is going on with you, little boy? You need to go ahead and do your homework. How about that? Ooh, it had some beeps on there. Oh yeah, poker's responsibility is going up. Okay, so I had Joker go ahead and take a shower so we have some more laundry. And how did she get 69 simoleons from that? You guys, what? <laughs> what, are the, what are you doing? No, 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 you're not gonna read the Book of Chaos. Absolutely not. But what we are gonna do, first of all, we can unload and put laundry away or it's still damp though huh it didn't dry out properly well we could unload and set laundry down or unload and put laundry away i don't understand what the difference is we're gonna go ahead and put it down let's see oh look at that oh, 
we got laundry. Oh my gosh, I thought she was going to put that on top of the candles. I was like, that's not a safe idea. Okay, so we could go ahead and add it back into the dryer because apparently our dryer didn't do a proper job. Or we could go ahead and put it in our inventory or put the laundry away. We're going to go ahead and just put this away just to check it out and see what that looks like. Oh, it just disappears. Okay, then. Well, that's a thing. So who is calling? Um, put in called us. She's going to be coming on over. Jinx, why don't you come over too? Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead. Uh oh, wait. Oh, he's going to go ahead and take care of Quinn already. Already. I was going to have Joker do the laundry, but you know what? It's all good. So we're going to go ahead and wash this. No, 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 not as Joker as Harley. We're going to go ahead and wash this in the wash tub with the grape clothes, the grape water. That's what we're going to do. All right, let's check on the dried clothes on the clothesline are they smelling up the place <gasps> look at that oh my gosh they look kind of dirty i don't know if that's just because of the shadows or something i'm not sure we could unload and set laundry down it is dry and the cleanness is supposedly pristine so this is what it's like to wash clothes in like normal nice looking regular water and it looks like pudding is coming on over so yes look when it's normal water <laughs> with flowers in it we got butterflies and bubbles and sparkles and it's just so beautiful so beautiful so that's a thing but that is interesting that you could add like spoiled food, rotten eggs and stuff like that and have a little prank or at least role play as if you're like pranking your roommates or your family with like dirty clothes. She's going to go ahead and wash clothes and once she is done, I'll be right back with you guys. All right, so now she's going to go ahead and put all of this laundry away, all of the dirty laundry. We're going to put it down and see if it's smelly. Huh? Is it smelly? Hmm? <gasps> I heard some flies. It's sparkling. Hold on. <gasps> Scent is foul. Look at that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so the cleanliness is supposedly pristine. It's dry and the scent is foul. <gasps> There's flies all over it. Look at this. Oh my goodness. How embarrassing is that? Okay, we're going to leave that right there. And we're going to move this down to the clothesline. So let's go ahead and check that out. Look at it. <laughs> That is actually hilarious. So hold on. But 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 I don't know whose laundry this is. So does that mean if uh, I put this away, these clothes are already clean? They're definitely not clean. But okay, let's go ahead and put this laundry away. I wonder if that means they'll be smelly. Will they be smelly when they change their clothes again? Oh my gosh, how hilarious is that? So okay, this is the clean laundry. So that is something. But look at the water. <gasps> Oh no, the water is super gross and dirty. So we're going to go ahead and replace that water. And I'm really curious. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, my boss is calling. Oh no, he's going, he's, he's trying to spend some time with this child, but he has to go to work. So we're going to go ahead and just, yeah. Joker is going to go back to work. We have work in 11 hours, so we still have time. We still have time to go ahead and check this out. So I'm very curious to see what it would look like if we actually took a shower. Will, will she change into dirty clothes? I'm really curious to see. She's very uncomfortable right now. So we're going to go ahead and see if she is smelly or not. Because if she is, that would be pretty hilarious. Alrighty, so she is changing. So does that mean when she's done, does that mean that she... Wait, what? Is she smelly? Huh? Is she... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, she made it a little accident. Uh, a little accident. Okay, we're going <laughs> to take a shower again. <laughs> we're going to take a second shower. Okay, so I'm just wondering. I'm just wondering if this affects the way they are. Like, will they be smelly the whole time? Is that how that works? All right, let's see. Let me see. Uh oh, trapped kitten. <gasps> Help the kitten. Help the kitten. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's see. She is very embarrassed because yes. Oh no, foul smelling clothing from wearing foul smelling laundry. Oh gross, who slipped the rotting food into the laundry load. Harley's clothing smells truly foul. So that actually does affect it. So you could like do pranks and stuff. That is hilarious, you guys. So I think we have explored everything that there is in this stuff pack. Um, For a laundry pack, that was actually pretty hilarious that they added that to keep things interesting and stuff like that and I love the creative sim stuff the build mode stuff I hate building but I actually really enjoy all of that building stuff and um let me know what you guys think about this thing because it definitely said that there was something magical about that so I need to know what's up with that is that supposed to be like a hint for an upcoming pack an upcoming expansion pack I think that might be a hint towards the uh, new game pack game pack I think where there's like world adventures or whatever maybe that's what it 
is. Because look at this. We have Diffuse's Mystic Protection, allowing spells to do more damage. What? What in the world? I don't know. But let me know what you guys think about this. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give this video a like. And if you are new, subscribe to become a mermaid or a merman. But thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.